I am so scared and I'm so nervous to film this video, but anything for the content. What's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Princess Tommy. If you're new here, if you're not new here, subscribe, give the video a huge thumbs up. Leave me a comment if y'all want a part two of this video to somebody else. Just, just drop it in the comment section below, okay? Okay. So, if you can't already tell about the title, today I will be doing the I'm in jail prank on my religious grandmother. So I am scared, y'all. I'm only scared because I don't know how she's gonna take it. She might fuck around and cry. She might, I don't know, y'all. I was trying to get my mom in on the prank for my mom. She's like, I'm not doing it. So whatever. Okay, so I got this like audio recording off of YouTube. And you know, I'm gonna let y'all hear it real quick so y'all can know what I'm talking about. This is a prepaid call from. I want to say my name, Tommy Baker. <laughs> an inmate at the county correctional facility. All phone calls are subject to recording and monitoring. To decline this call, press 9 now and to accept this call, press 1 now. Do you want to press 9? Thank you. Your call has been accepted. And then I'm going to start talking while this audio is in the background. Wonderful. So I just got finished downloading the little text now app. So. I got my number on text now and I'm going to call my grandma. Knowing my grandmother, she's probably going to, she's going to answer, but it's going to take her like a while to answer the phone call. So y'all know I'm the OG when it comes to the prank calls. When I find a prank call, my prank calls, they, they go too far. They go up. I had to switch it up today. And this one right here, it's going to be a banker. All right. The reason I'm in jail is going to be because... I got, I was driving to the mall and this lady cut me off and I got really bad road rage. And she told me, I ain't gonna see her though. I ain't gonna fight her. And I fought her and I beat her up so bad that she, <laughs> like, I beat her up so bad she called the police on me. And the police came and they locked me up for um, assault or whatever. And everybody in my family knows like I have really bad road rage. So it's gonna be believable. Alright, I ain't gonna talk y'all head off too much. I'm gonna just go ahead and call my grandmother. Again, no one heard she thought I'm going to She's like, who is this girl? This is a prepaid call from Tommy Baker, an inmate at the county correctional facility. All phone calls are subject to recording and monitoring. To decline this call, press 9 now and to accept this call, press 1 now. Hello? Thank you. Your call has been accepted. Hello? Where yeah. Are you? What do you mean, where am I? You in jail? They got me in the holding cell. For what? I was driving, and this lady cut me off while I was driving. And what happened? When I was driving and she cut me off, I started chasing her with my car because she almost caused me to get into an accident. So where are you locked up at? Somewhere down here in Virginia. In Virginia? Yeah. You don't know where? Um, I was going down to like Tyson's. Uh huh. And then she cut me off, so I started chasing her with my car. And then she was like, "Get out the car and fight me." Then, so we started fighting. So how far? How far are you in Virginia? Come on, I don't know. You don't know where you locked up at? No, whatever jail. Are they gonna release you? I have to go to court because they're trying to charge me with assault. Oh my God. So oh, you're in Virginia by Tyson. Yes. Are you okay? I mean, I just got a black eye, but other than that, I'm okay. Was she white or black? She was white. I see, in Virginia, they don't play Tommy. You by yourself? Grandma, who else would I be with? Okay. So you gotta go to court tomorrow? Yeah, I mean, because it's Sunday, so I can't do nothing today. They're gonna hold me tonight, and then... I think they said something about seeing a judge in the morning. Okay, so you tell them that you that she almost hit you. Don't say so somebody called 
called the police on you? No, the police was right there. Like it was like bumper to bumper traffic after I had mm -hmm. after I had caught up to her. So you're somewhere in Virginia. I need to find out where you are lost up in Virginia. So you had a you had a, a, a jail you had a precinct. What is it? So I need to, So that need to find out where exactly you are. So are you okay though? Are you scared? No, not really. The girls are not threatening you, are they? No, I've only been here for like four hours. Your mom know? Yeah, I called my mom before I called you. Oh, baby, we should, you need me to do, we, should, we need to get you out of there. So you don't know what time you going to court in the morning? No. Okay, I need to find a, um, I need to find out what jail is near Tyson to find out. Oh, Lord, baby. I'm just gonna pray for you. What do you mean you're gonna pray for me? I mean, just be careful in there. I don't want you in no prison. Well, the lady shouldn't have I cut me off. Baby, let me tell you something. And I've been trying to say it. People are gonna do things. You have control of your of whatever. People are gonna say things. People are gonna do things. Now they, they wanna lock us up. So we have to be smarter. Just because she tried to cut you off regardless. Don't you know they will set us up to just get our asses locked up? We have to be smarter. We have to control our temper. If nobody did any bother around that she didn't do anything, baby. We have to control our temper. Sometimes we react and then we it's too late. It's too late. And the worst thing you want to do is to get in the system. And Virginia don't play. They don't play. They change the laws for anything. It might be a little battery, whatever, but then they can talk you with whatever. This to get us in the system, and we have to be smarter. I asked them. I was like, well, I don't want to be here. So, like, I was asking about my bond. And they, what they say? They said, like... There's no bond? No, they told me if I was... They said they're going to see what they can do, but they was like, if they was going to give me bond or whatever... It'll be like three, like three thousand. Okay, so if it's three thousand, then you just gotta pay three hundred. Yeah, because you only gotta pay half or whatever. Right. So, baby, this is what I want you to do: just be cool, don't mouth that, don't get smart, just, just go with it. You know, just, you know, we, we, we got to get the attitude up. We can't give it to them. We can't do that. What you mean, just go with it? Like, if they try, I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, don't like be talking smart and this and that. It's just like. Okay, you know, this, this... To the people in boy, jail? Huh? That's it. I'm just saying, like, you know, this, don't be like, get off of me. And, you know, sometimes people resist and whatever, like, well, she shouldn't have done this, she shouldn't have done that. Just say, you know, you were afraid for whatever. You never knew. You didn't know what was going to happen. And that's what I've been trying to tell granddad. You, people going to say something. You, you can't be mouthing back with these people. If they're not doing nothing, you should not have gotten off the car or you shouldn't have been following her. It could have turned out worse. Yeah, she... But I just thank God that you're okay. You can't be out there fighting people, pull feet, so people are stabbing and shooting. You know? I just love you so much, baby. I just love you so much. Well... So you in the cell by yourself? I haven't been into a cell yet. Oh, okay. So how big was the girl? She wasn't that big, for real. Was she by herself? She had, like, her sister in the car or something. I need to black your eyes. Is your eye okay? Yep. So we need to be to court with you. Maybe they'll let you come out tonight if they set a bail. Did they lock the girl up too? Yeah. Since it was both parties, they asked, you know, did we want to press charges? I said no, because I didn't think it was that serious. But she said she wanted to charge me for it. So. But then you need to press charges against her too. You need to press charges against her too. I'm not a snitch. That's not, that ain't got nothing to do with this. So you don't want to end up going to jail for some mess. If she press charges against you, then you need to press charges against her. We need to find a lawyer to come. You talk to Joe? No, I haven't called him. I only get two calls. Oh, okay. And the call's about to be over. I think I got like 20 seconds left. All right, baby. I'm going to try to find a, um, try to find out what jail you are down for Virginia. All right, girl. Because they do all kinds of... Okay, love you. Grandma. Yes? This was a prank. Why did you do that? Tommy. No, it wasn't a prank because you called. 
It was a bit. It was an audio recording. No, I heard it say prepaid card. This is a different number. I got a fake number. No, you didn't, Pooh. I did. No, you didn't. You sound like you were in the prison. Tommy, you're lying. Grandma, I'm in my house. FaceTime me then. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Why'd you do that? Oh my gosh. Jesus Lord. My oh gosh. Why did you do that to me? Oh my gosh. Oh Lord Jesus. Alright y'all, so after like damn near 20 minutes of trying to convince my grandma that I'm not in jail and her giving me his long spiel and speech of how I'm gonna try you, you so, you too beautiful, you know, how grandmas are. I actually, she actually had a better reaction <laughs> than what I thought. Like when I called, she was trying to get in contact with me via the jail, like immediately. Like, like did y'all hear her press eight or nine before the call even like, you know, went through or whatever. But there's a lot of people in my family who I can do this prank on. So comment down below if y'all want me to do this prank on my family again or like anybody in my family. Because this was, oh, she's she's literally calling me back again. Apology. I owe you an apology. Yes, my heart is racing. I'm sorry for pranking you. So I want to prank somebody. How can I do it? All right, you guys, sorry this video got dragged out longer than what it was supposed to be. But my grandma, she just kept calling me, like, back to back to back to back. And by the time I got the phone on her, it was too late already to upload the video. But I'm here on camera to do it now. Y'all know who the OG of the friend calls is. It's your girl, home with the Princess Tommy. I switched the content up today just to play around with it a bit and see how it does. So I hope you all really did enjoy this video. If you want to see me do more pranks like these on like different random people or like my family members, definitely comment that down below. Everything don't got to be, oh, I took your man or I took your girlfriend. Like it don't always got to be that. It's okay to switch it up sometimes. So I really enjoy filming this video. My grandma is here. She was pissing me. But she actually handled it um a lot better than I expected her to. She was very supportive. And, um you know, she was still mad, but she was supportive too which my family always is, but, you know, we love that. I love y'all so much. If y'all want to see a part two, or if you want to see a part two to this video, definitely comment that down below, and I'll make sure to put it in the works for y'all. I love y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next video.